No surrender. We finish what we started. Bastard! Hey folks, Dave here, and welcome back to some adventuring here in Kingdom Come Deliverance. I'm continuing my series of spoiler-free side quest adventuring where I'm trying to show you guys how awesome and really just fantastic this game is without spoiling the main quest. I am planning on some kind of wrap-up review once I finish the game, but that could be a while from now. I'm 45-ish hours into the game, and I'm not even 25% to the story from what people are telling me. What I'm going to do today is we're going to go bandit hunting. I've just finished up some other side quests. My armor is washed and repaired, and I'm ready to hit the road. I've been given some information about some possible bandit encampments in the forest northwest of Ratai. I'm going to go check it out and see what we can do about it. I'm going to turn my UI back on here for a second, and I'll show you guys what my current gear looks like. Looks like my sword is still a bit bloodied from the journey up here, but I'm using a long sword that I won in a uh, knightly duel, which is pretty fantastic. I've also got a mod that makes the black hood actually be added over top of your armor, which looks pretty awesome. I'm going for kind of a darker Robin Hood look here, and I think it works pretty well. My bow for now is just a simple hazel hunting bow, but it's got some good power behind it. And I'm using long distance arrows for relatively easy accuracy. Beyond that, that's what my armor looks like. I think we're all set. It's time to hit the road. Yep, there is our bandit assignment. And we're going to head actually down here on horseback to take out the camp, even though it's pretty far to the south, because I've had some nasty encounters on the road, and I want to clean things up as we go, just in case. And for the sake of you guys, I will go ahead and just trim down the footage if we don't run into any troublemakers along the way. Again guys, this game has been impressing me in so many ways, and I wanted to do another episode with some fighting, because I've been leveling up both my in-game skills as Henry and my abilities as a player, I really feel like I'm getting a good handle on the combat system now. The fighting is wonderful, it is so intense, and honestly I'd love to see more games and other genres from these guys with this style of combat because it's got such interesting depth to it. This guy is dressed like a bandit. I'll slay you. Bring it. Oh, yep, they've got back up. So what I'm gonna do is pull my bow out here. You call that combat. I'm gonna kill their archer with a shot to the stomach there. And if this guy wants an honorable duel, well, I'll give him one. Oh. Well, the perk that I have that adds the possibility of an instant knockout with a hit to the head came in handy there. <laughs> well, that's not a bad start. It is pretty awesome with how weak you are in the beginning of the game, which I love the fact that you're just a peasant. You are a nobody. When you get to this point and you finally have some good perks and you've got a handle on the combat, you really do feel like you're pretty badass all of a sudden. It just feels awesome to actually have to work your way up in the combat. I think I was up into the, uh, in probably the 30s in hours before I felt like I had a good handle on things. They're carrying quite a bit of goblets and whatnot worth a pretty penny for sure. These hunter gloves, guys, these things are... <laughs> money. Easy money. 0.5 weight and usually over a hundred uh, as far as value goes in Groshen. Get my loyal steed here. Come on, Roach. That's right. 
I found Roach in game. I won't spoil it, but when you find her, there's some fantastic dialogue from the merchant about who he bought Roach from. Tell you what, guys, it's good to have my trusty Steve back. Alright. Let's keep on going. Uh, who's this guy? Just a priest? I probably just saved you from getting robbed. Off we go. Who do we have here? Just a merchant, I guess. I think we've got a fork in the road here. Yep. We'll head a bit southwest because this forest looks awesome. What do we have here? Looks like a group of bandits and guards are fighting. I'm going to help them out here. Ow. There goes one. Uh, are those bandits chasing a guard? Roach, come on. I can't tell who's fighting who here. Yep, I think it's bandits cornering a guard. Wait, guys, stop running around. Uh, I gotta try to get an arrow notch so I can save him. Blind firing through the bushes, what can go wrong? Wow, they're running fast. Ooh, okay, yeah, almost hit the guard there. Let's just get Roach, come on. They're not paying attention. Priority is going to be getting this bandit off the guard, though. Don't you run. Ah, oh, the guard died. That was a great time for a stab. No, no, forget it. Now you die. You beast! Just... And with the cheap shot. Hey, what are you up to? Look at that, buddy. What's going on there? I killed your friend. Hey, who's there? The answer to my prayers. Just when I wanted to vent my rage on someone. Uh, oh. yeah. the combos here. Uh, oh. Nope, he comboed me. Yeah. Come and get me. Uh. Uh. Shit. Uh. 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 Ooh, that last one missed pretty bad. You think you're good, do you? Oh wow, it almost looked like the impact of my block just completely killed him. Trusty companion, short sword, that's mine now. Shield heavy, that's also mine. 
guys, for an episode that's supposed to be about hunting bandits, we haven't even gotten <laughs> to the objective yet. This is going quite well. Well, with our bandits stripped clean, and me now wearing one of their darker black hoods, also conveniently covered in scary looking blood, it's time to continue our bandit hunt. Which again is going really, really well. These roads really are dangerous. We're still, man, quite a while out from the objective. Let's get riding. South we go. Again. This section of the forest is just absolutely beautiful. I mean, the whole game is, but this part especially. Extra TLC, I think, because some of the main quest goes through here. Well, that's grim. With any luck, we're gonna go find ourselves some bandits and dispense some slightly faster justice than just the hangman's noose. I think this might be the forest that we're looking for here. I haven't done a whole lot of sneaking, so this might be a good opportunity to perhaps wait for nightfall and see if I can sneak in some. Oh yeah, guys, this is our forest. I did just recently get a couple of stealth perks, which is great because I've barely messed with stealth so far in the game. I've been mostly a Robin Hood knight character, but my noise is now pretty low. Now if I put on my shoes that I bought, quiet dark boots, my noise is down to 18. I don't think I can stab quietly yet, though. But perhaps I can get some cheap shots in with the bow. Yeah, let's wait until it's darker and see how things go. I left just a little bit of daylight for us here, guys so that I can sneak up carefully on the camp, because as you guys can see, the terrain's a bit nasty here. Beautifully detailed as far as environment art goes, this looks awesome, but I didn't want to trip and fall off of a cliff or something in the dark. This game does get dark at night, so... As the light fades, Let's figure out how we can sneak up in this camp here. Okay, um... I see some clothes hanging out to dry and one guy walking in the bushes. Got this huge cliffside here that I think I'm gonna go around. Get on the southwest side of the camp instead. I might try and sneak in, and if there's patrols, kill a few of those silently. I don't have the perk where I can even use the dagger yet for quiet kills, that's how low level my stealth is, but I can at least knock people out quietly. Only problem is, once I do that, I've got to move pretty fast because they will wake up. Okay, this should be enough flanking. Let's start sneaking. Love those quiet shoes. Got a guard right there on patrol. 
let's try and sneak up behind him here. Perhaps get a knockout. Who's there? What's going on there? They might have seen me over at the camp briefly. This is awkward. Hey, who's that? That gets Blood Rush going. Now Whoa. they know what's up. Get over here. What are you doing? Oh, a headshot. And that was the camp leader, too. Over here. Where is everyone? Quick. <laughs> wow, nice dodge. You though. None of that. You fucked up there. <gasps> Did I? Let's try a combo. Up slash, right slash. Nope, he's too far away. Got a nasty hit on him there. You win. Look at me, Archer. Look at me. Couldn't save your friend, could ya? Oh, wow, that was a good hit. Guys, I just slaughtered this camp. Straight up massacred. Got some lucky hits in there, but man. Is that all of them? Gonna have to get a torch out just to loot here. Not sure why it was so hard to activate the knockout on that one scout. I wonder if I wasn't as hidden as I thought I was. Oh, this guy slid down into the fire. What you got here? Did they even land a single hit on me? I don't think so. I could use a good snack though. Put my longsword away here. Eat some bandit stew. They're all set for dinner here. And let's see what's inside the treasure chest. Of course it's in the back corner here. go. Gloves, uh, sword, noble's boots, villager's bow. I think this is just some of their gear. It's not fantastic. No jewelry or other valuable loot. That just sucked for that guy right into the fire. Oh, the unconscious guy. Crap, where did he go? Bandit unconscious. Well. Well, I never. The pig turns up willingly for the slaughter. Ah! And he woke up. Oh, yeah. ah. I <laughs> fist fight, huh? All right, I'll fist fight. He's a good wrestler, at least. Oh. I think I need him in the face and killed him, guys. <laughs> Alright. Take his ear. 
as a trophy so I can get paid <laughs> in the style of girl to Rivia. Gotta take a trophy with me. Tell you what, guys. Henry, like a true alpha bandit hunter, is going to sleep in their camp until daylight. That way we don't miss any of these loot pinatas, formerly known as bandits. Well, it's technically morning, but the rain is actually heavier now. It's almost darker out here. Looks like the bodies are gone. So I'm going to go ahead and head out and turn in all of these bandit ears and get paid. Oh, hey Roach. Just as powerful in your teleportation as you were in The Witcher, I see. <laughs> Alright guys. Let's head back to Rate. What's this then? A bandit ambush so close to town? Really? Maybe he just wants to talk. Well, well. Now what have we here? What's that he's bringing us? Show me what you've got, and maybe we won't kill you. Go to hell. <laughs> you call that combat? <laughs> Oh, I hope you enjoyed that cheap hit, friend. <laughs> well landed. That's the only one I'm going to give you. Oh, wow. <laughs> Time for mercy kill. <laughs> Nothing like one last loot pinata. Right before town. Not bad. Not bad at all. <laughs> you know, guys, we might eventually make it back to the city. Roach appears to be completely unfazed by all that. I came too, although it looks like I'm going to be waiting here for a little while for Captain Bernard to day, head to the training area so I can turn in these bandit ears, which I imagine start to smell kind of bad after a while. Let's go ahead and wait, see if he shows up. There's the good captain. Henry, I'm glad you came. <laughs> the bandits were definitely not glad that I came. Good night. How may I serve you? I've taken care of the camp. Where's the proof? Here is. Good work. Forty groschen. And that's not Cheapskate. all. Cheapskate. There's some trouble on the road to Sassau. There's most likely another camp thereabouts. All right, I'll take a look around. 
And let's also take care of those trophies. I have some uh, trophies. Let's see. Good. Good. That's how to treat the bastards. I don't think any from that camp managed to escape. Sometimes they'll retreat and you have to chase them down, but they all died fighting in the dark there. All right, guys. Well, that is some very efficient bandit hunting there from Henry the... Uh, what would it be in this case? <laughs> Henry the Merciless, I guess. No bandit survived that journey. Hope you guys have enjoyed. Again, this game is fantastic. Also, again, watch out for a final review from me whenever I manage to actually make it through the main quest. For now, hope you guys have enjoyed. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you all next time.